Hey, what's up, everyone? This is Super Reploid CLE. How are you guys doing on YouTube? In this vlog, I'm going to talk about Windows and Macintosh. I'm going to first start off with Macintosh. When I was very, very little, prior to this age right now, um, I used to utilize this computer called, well, at first, when I first got familiar with it, <clears throat> that was back when I was in elementary and kindergarten. They had these computers, right? where kids can play on it to do some educational work and the opening looked very looked very um, synthetic and awesome but uh, right when I was using it it had some um, programs when I was in elementary school they showed it again they had those kind of computers too which was very awesome now next time I'm going to talk about Windows you know, like Windows XP, Windows Vista, Windows 7, Windows 8, etc., etc., etc. Now, <clears throat> for Windows, they have the stuff that they have are very, very different than Macintosh. So, they have different openings, different start menus, different programs, different regulations of how they work. Now, the comparisons between Windows and Macintosh is that they sometimes use the same thing. Some programs are actually the same, but they sometimes work differently and when it comes to their windows you know the uh, box windows where they have the minimize button and the maximize button and the close button for Macintosh they have red button for uh, I think for close or, or is it I can't remember how they go but they have the three buttons yellow red and green and for windows they have the small line for minimize the square for maximize and X for close with that being insinuated my question is this which one is better? Is it Windows or is it Mac? And what do you guys think as well? If you guys like Windows, comment on the comment section, Windows. If you guys like Macintosh, comment on the comment section, Macintosh. My opinion whatsoever is Windows because Windows is awesome. It's very easy to use. Now, a lot of people may think that Macintosh is easy to use because I used Macintosh before, but I'd rather stick to Windows. And in reference to Windows, last night on my laptop, on my Windows 8 laptop, it showed me a notification saying get Windows 10 and when I clicked on it it says to update oh no upgrade from Windows 8 to Windows 10 and they also said if I upgrade to Windows 10 there might be some graphical issues depending on the graphics card and in reference to upgrades I'm going to talk about updates people of YouTube and subscribers of my YouTube listen carefully a few years ago on my other laptop I had these updates right and they also have one update where they say installed Windows Internet Explorer 9 as an update. So after I got the update carried out, I restarted my computer after the updates to finish the updating. And when they already set up Windows Internet Explorer 9 for me, I went to open it. So when I open it, it just suddenly crashes out. And it also made my other programs dysfunctional, like Fruity Loop Studio or Download Accelerator Plus and a few other programs as well, though I don't quite remember what they were, but I know those two were the ones that were acting funny since I got the Internet Explorer 9 that time. But my words to you all, just because updates enhance some stuff doesn't mean they'll work out right. Despite the fact that I myself love technology so much, I still gotta keep watch for what I update. So again, if you like Windows or Macintosh, just comment which one do you like the better in the comment section. But anyway, that's all I got for you guys for this vlog. I hope you guys enjoy watching it. Be sure to check out my other video responses, vlogs, reviews and other videos that I have on my channel. More videos to come. This is Super Reploid CLE. Like, comment, subscribe, favorite, and share. See you guys on the next video.